How's it going everyone? Today I'm going to show you how to get this Thagen armor. Now this Thagen armor is a bear class armor. So if you are a heavy melee user, this is probably the best set for you currently. Um, I'm not going to be one of those that throw that out there and say this is the best armor in the game because they're build based. This is one of the best armors if you're a melee based character. If you're someone that does stealth, this isn't going to be the greatest armor in the world for you. But I'm going to show you how to get it and just to prove that you can get this at a low level. I'm just going to show you that I am only power 43. So anyone can get it. I do recommend if you are looking at getting some armors and you're going to have to go to some high difficulty areas. We can respick our skills whenever we want highly recommend you pick up advanced assassinations that way all those high level enemies that you need to get your keys from you'll be able to take them down as long as you've got the time and well based and for those moments when you manage to get the boss down or something but there's another guy nearby i'd also recommend getting chain assassination as well and it also be links up to the timed one so it works out really well if you are someone who's a low level having to go into the higher level areas we're going to start off with the braces um, you'll need to come up north to Northumbria and you'll need to come to a camp right here uh, It is gonna be a high level camp. So if you are a low level like myself, it is gonna be a little bit difficult But by picking up the perk That allows us to do high level targets for the time based you'll be able to get this Just need to make sure you're timing your assassinations, right? So you can get your instas So you just want to follow my steps. So we need to kill him because he has a key. And that key is going to be vitally important for this. We're dead. Right, forget we're running people. Right, and there's the armor. We got it. What? We got the braces, but now we got to get out of here. Okay, people, and for this next piece of the Thagan armor, you're going to want to head it to a Winchester. Well, Winchester is right down there in the corner of the map. There's a nice zoomed out view for you. The armor is right there, but we're going to require three keys to get this piece of armor. Um, so what you want to do is you want to head to where I am on the map. Okay, and the first key that we need for this armor is right in top of the tower. Just climb it right up to the very top. There is going to be a set of baskets. I'll show you where we are. Right in the big tower, right in the middle. Show you on the map again. What you want to do is you just want to break these baskets, slide through here. You're going to find the key right there. Right, on to the next one. Okay, the next key for this piece of the armor set is that inside this big building here, which is pretty close to where the armor itself is. We're just going to run in here. This is quite an easy one to get. It's literally right there, look. Right on that beam. So you just want to climb up. Keep going. And it is right there. And then the final one... Okay, the third and final key is also right in here, people. Just head straight to the back. Head through this doorway here. We're going to go right here. We're going to jump over this. And that is the final key that we needed. So now we can go get this piece of armor. Okay, and to get the actual armor, guys, you want to head right here. So all the keys are dotted around this place. Once you've got the final key, head out the front door and just go to the right. You're going to come to this courtyard here, show you on the map. We're right there. 
There's going to be a glass window there. You're just going to shoot that out. And then all you got to have to do is climb up and claim the next piece of the armor. And there it is. Right. We have two pieces. On to the next one. Okay, everybody. This is the next piece of the armor. You're going to want to head all the way north, just south of Jorvik now. So I hope you've got a fast travel up there. There's going to be a little place here called the Temple of Brig Brigatania. Brigatania? Brigatania? Can't pronounce it. Anyway, far beyond the point. You're going to want to look the behind the statue. There's a little location just there. You head over there. You're just going to want to dive down. This could be a long swim, this one. So make sure you're doing it with speed so that you don't drown. And then we've got a long swim all the way around to go grab this piece of armor. Just keep going. It's a pretty straight swim, so it's just a long one. But it's going to be right there. And we got it. Okay. And we'll go on to the next one now. Okay, everyone. This is the final piece of the armor. We want to head to Gloucester. Go right over to the left-hand side of the map. Show you a nice zoomed out view. You're looking for a place called Aeowulf. And when you are there, you're looking for a big brute that guy right there because we need his key so i'm going to grab his key and then join me straight after okay once you've got his key you're going to want to have a look literally so that is i'm trying to show you with him but he's fine really awkwardly i'll just show you here right so there he is dead got his key we fly here oh, now literally just there below us is going to be an entrance way so we're just going to jump down here unlock the door and there it is this is the final piece of the armor skiddish we got it all right and then you can just fast travel out unless you want to get the book if you want to get the book go get the book that's another video for me, so I'm getting the book. Okay, so the reason why this armor is probably one of the better ones is because it is a kind of tank armor, which if you are a melee based character is pretty good. Increased critical chance when parrying, additional increased critical damage. So it is a pretty strong set if you are a melee user. Of course, I'm going to have lots of tutorials coming out on how to get the best Raven armor. I believe it's probably the Magister and the i can't think of the range one but i'll get a video on it but guys thanks for watching have yourselves a beautiful day and bye bye